Good morning YouTube, this is Melody. I want to share with you two projects I've been working on. I contacted Nurse Tara. She's doing a women of color tag swap and it was something that I found very interesting and I love her work. So I asked her if she would um, be interested in trading tags with me and she readily agreed and I'm really happy about that. This is what I've been working on. Um, we agreed to do an extra large size. Mine are 4 by 8 and we are going to do one vintage and one shabby chic style, our own interpretation of that. This one is my shabby chic um, version. I used a black, uh, what do you call it, um, lightweight chipboard and I ran it through my embossing folder using one of my Tim Holtz embossing folders. The image of this gorgeous woman I found on the internet. Tara said that she liked the black and pink combo so that's what I went with. I have some Prima flowers and then I've done a little bit of paint dabbing on the edges. There's some pearls, uh, black bling, my very first stick pin that I've ever made. Um, I added that one. I liked that it's like iridescent bubbles so it picks up the pinks in all different colors. I did some chalk edging along the edges of the picture as well as um, a little bit around the image. Then I went back over it with some pink acrylic paint. Let's see, there's some pink lace peeking out under here, a white doily that I added a little bit of the pink chalk ink to. Mom, have to go to the bathroom. Okay, baby. I ran, um, just dabbed paint along the edges with my finger. There's a little bit of pearl in there, and I added a few pieces of bling just to give it shine. I think I'm done with this one, not quite sure. Oh, and I added my ribbons and a little bit of those uh, lace bindings you can get from Joann's. I think I'm done with this one. My next one, um, I'd like some feedback on the whole project, if you would. I am not sure I'm done with this. I may start over, in fact. Um, beautiful image of Lena Horn. I wanted it to have the effect of being like an old damaged photo that you find somewhere and I've used some Graphic 45 um, fussy tickets that I fussy cut from one of their pages. Graphic 45 jazz uh, dancers on the background. I used a couple of different um, inks to damage or uh, give the photo a patina. I hope you can see it. I'm trying to film outside so you can pick up the uh, metallic colors. and. I did a little bit on her face to give it some interest. Maybe if I tilt it, you can see it. I've got some, um, sorry about my finger, got some bling there, got some um, flowers that I've added a little bit of um, glossy accents to, and I've got some faceted bling some lace, some ribbon, and I've done some glimmer misting around the card to give it some shine and shimmer. Haven't decided on my ribbons yet. So anyway, this is what I've been working on. Um, please leave me some feedback and some comments. Let me know what you think. I'm, again, not really sure about this one. This was supposed to be my vintage type, so I tried to go with like the browns and the rust and the... Uh, give it a, a hint of old, if you will. So thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.